So excellent. Hi, welcome. This, this is, is uh, Power Block. The Power Block you've always wanted. Pretty much. <laughs> well, now it's not just me, like, or Ben, or somebody just sitting in front of the screen going, oh, right. uh, here's right. what I'm going to do. It's pretty much, we get to talk the way we, we usually do when we're, uh, when we're working. Yeah, so the, the formula is always going to be a bunch of things going on at the same time. It could be anything from cooking tacos yeah. to making some music to, uh, you know, filming some shorts. Just going outside and talking. Or going, going outside and talking. Once I get the hat brim cam so you can see what I'm looking at, like look at my screen and, you know, you can see if I look down at my crotch or whatever, but. Can you give me some uh, paper towels there? Thanks, man. See while I'm looking at Ben. Ooh. He's giving me some, some deep knowledge. <laughs> All right, hold on. I gotta take the headphones off for a second. Word. So we're still, we're still. Uh, oh, that's why. This is oh, the relaunch wait power a second. Lock, but we're still, we're still working out the the kinks. I didn't have the mic on. Now I sound way better, right? Am I louder now? Wait, where was the mic? Was on the table, wasn't it? No, the mic was on my neck. I didn't um, have it on all the way. Ah. Uh, it's been a while. Did you put my creamer in the other fridge, please. <laughs> All right, in the creamery. So, so who do we got? Who's who's around? I uh, see I see Glacier Nestor. What's up? How's it going? Yeah, you've been missing out. You've been missing out. We've been missing out not doing them. I've been mm -hmm. so busy that I couldn't I couldn't take the time to stream at all because I've been utterly overwhelmed with daily work. But now. This nah. new schedule is going to change our lives. Yo, it's CoStar. I see CoStar in here. What up, Co? Um, I know we're going to be doing some technical stuff on the fly. Jake, how do you feel about um, mm. putting chat on the screen as well? I'm like not me? entirely opposed to it. Okay. Hey, Benjamin Buttons. I don't think he's got his mic up yet, so I don't know if he's talking yeah. yet. Hold on a second. Hey, the, Ben. Uh, the idea is to get the entire... Can you do me a favor? Can you scoot the... The camera feeds over a little bit to the right and then put a chat on the left. No. Yes, baby. Yeah. Some things we've been working on. Yeah. So as I've been not streaming, these guys have been still streaming. So they're getting practice and... Why don't you get a mic so I can hear you through here? Because I'm not going to keep taking this thing off to talk to you. Yeah, the, the idea is to have us all on mic so that we can hear each other throughout the entire day of streaming. Do you hear a burp? And you can hear you guys get to hear what what utterly idiotic things we say to each other throughout the course of a day. And, and trust me, how's this? They are idiotic. Yeah, it sounds great. Awesome. Ben, you sound you sound awesome. marvelous. Robert, do you want chat on? Screen? I don't have Ben. Well, ben, what's it? What's on, on Ben? Oh, you're on one. Ben's on, on one. Talk, Ben. I do you want a tablet or would you like the chat on the display? You know what? Why don't you support? No, 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 not on the display. Just move the move the feeds over a little bit to the right so we have a left side available. And then you can surprise me on however you want it to look. Okay, I so think like I'm the go with the tablet. The window, but whatever. We'll get chat up soon. Thank you. Well, okay. the window quadrants will be, uh, the window quadrants are on the, uh, like, moved over to the right, right maybe? I don't know. Okay, Matt, you want to talk to me? Get headphones on, so that way I can hear you. Yeah, no, any, but don't talk to me without headphones. <laughs> that's, that's the rule. I don't want to, don't talk to me without headphones. No, no, not that one. Get your own mic. <laughs> And don't put that on your butt. <laughs> that was disgusting. Uh, you guys wanted it. Here it is. Yeah. Unfiltered, pure mint potion stupidity. We actually get work done. We, we do actually get paid. It's unbelievable, but we do actually get things done. No. Uh, pretty, much, pretty much despite ourselves. No, I want it on there. I know. Just a second. Though. All right. That's my, okay. <laughs> that's my temporary band-aid. All right. That's fine. All right. So I have a massive up here. I think I'm going to work with Serum. Do I even have it installed? I have an older version installed. Wait, what are you doing? What are you going to be doing? I'm going to be doing um, synth patches for New Ren. Because I've been writing I've been writing the New Ren dialogue and lyrics and story for the past few weeks. I've been like a like a man possessed. I finally got a, a non-shitty enough idea to actually do it. Share with the public? Yeah. Actually, to put out there. Excellent. I've been trying so hard, racking my brain to try to come up with a plot that wasn't just totally contrived or just a total ripoff of something else. I didn't just want it to be the Matrix. <laughs> I wanted it to kind of, kind of skirt the line between maybe. The whole game is everybody just taking blue pills and red pills. Yeah, just red pills and blue pills. Yeah. Well, 
it's basically it's it's what if um if you've ever read um I have no mouth and I must scream. Uh, it is it's kind of like AM the the evil computer the tripartite god. Mic check. Ooh, cool. Ooh, there's some squab squigglies in there. Are you on the same channel I am? Amplitude modulation. That's a useful synthesis effect. He's on the same channel as me. Oh. Oh. I'm serious. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> You're welcome, Robbie. You're welcome. You're on the wrong channel. You're welcome, Robbie. All right, now we need to turn him way down. What's up, man? <laughs> welcome right. to our stream. Matt, you want to sous chef me or what? I gotta leave in a little bit. Perfect. What are you leaving? Twenty-five minutes. Yeah, that's fine. You can test out the guacamole. It's not gonna be that long to make it. All right. Test the guacamole tester. What's your problem? Huh? Dude, we're getting all new knives. You think this is the, you think this is the permanent set we're gonna be having here? I yeah. want to know where my hankle went. Hey, I can, I can, knife I can tell you where your hankle went. Disappeared from the mid portion kitchen. Mm hmm. What's a hankle? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you knew I was going to be like playing it like, oh, yeah, hankles. Yeah. <laughs> don't get me started. I can tell the way for you. Why don't you just wait until I got more stuff for you? You know, you can get another headphone set and you can hang out with me in here if you want. If you want. You don't necessarily have to. You can just, just so at least if you're going to have a conversation with me. I can't hear you now. You turned your thing off. <laughs> Still off. Yeah, Robbie, move the mic away from your mouth to breathe. I feel like a moron. Is that better? There you go. I should have a gate on. The gate might need to be adjusted. That's pretty good. Yeah, yeah, we figure if there's constant distractions and there's something happening. I mean, there there are anyway while I'm working oh, on damn, a, looks in a normal day. Mm, except for that. That looks nasty. So I'd rather give you guys a slice of that than, than just having to host the show myself for any number of hours while I'm trying to make something. Right. Because I end up rambling incoherently. Or even coherently is almost as bad. I don't want to just like... All right. Let me see if I got a... All right, cool. Ooh, that's nice. Yeah. For anyone who um, who's wondering, yeah, I need that hat brim can so I could show you guys what I'm actually looking at. But I have an Ableton push controller. I have an Ableton. Oh, I got to turn you down on my headphones. There yeah, we go. That's yeah. better. It's music, that's a pure square wave, so it's going to make up? your ears bleed. All right. Okay. So while you're setting up your square waves, making mm. the guacamole. Okay, so my guacamole... I'm just going to tell you a little bit about my, about my guac. You guys ready? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I had a roommate named Jen. Jen first showed me this recipe, and I've modified it throughout the years. Basically, it's avocados, obviously, red onions, tomatoes. You have cilantro, and then I added my own little spices on top of that, which is garlic salt. Put some lime on top, it's squeezed. And then the pista resistance. One single serrano pepper? One single serrano pepper. Okay. Cut it. Don't use the whole thing. <laughs> you only use half of it, okay? Man just swaps in a ghost pepper and we're all just crying. I wouldn't day. doubt <laughs> it. I wouldn't doubt it at all. Yeah. That's, hey, you want to cut it? Do you want it diced or sliced? Or you want Di it? I want it diced. You want it diced. All right. I will dice your onion for you. All right. Yeah, this is this is how oh, it's going to be. Look, I'm on TV. All right, this is cool. Hey. Hold on. You know what? I'm going to give you the headphones so I can get a splitter in here so we can both have a conversation with Matt or with uh, Jake at the same time. This knife sucks. Yeah, Matt can't hear what I'm saying. He can Man, now. Matt's such a jerk. Bro, I can hear you now. Oh, and... snap. All right, well. I have to use a fillet knife since our, that's, I guess that's a, since our other knife isn't working properly. It's not sharp. Wait, what channel are you on, Matt? Are you on channel three? I'm on channel four. Because I see three. Oh, I'm on four. It's changing the volume. I sound like I have a rotary pedal. Huh. So, yeah, we, we don't really have a structure for this show as much as we are just going to show you what whatever we're working on that day, whether it's making tacos or making synth patches or whatever. It's uh, it's more of a freeform sort of chill with us while we're doing our thing. Um, kind of the way a game streamer kind of just streams and has a good time and, and plays a game and enjoys it sometimes and... Uh, and talks about it. 
or has people on talks with them. But we're gonna we're gonna just sort of give you a little bit of a day in the life. It's like take your take your audience to work day every day here. So I'm pretty pretty excited. One in the world. Oh, rating? There's rating now in Twitch? That's freaking awesome. Yeah, yeah. Twitch Twitch says if a raid is offensive, moderate in chat settings. The concept of a raid is somewhat offensive. What what it what exactly is uh is a raid? And why is it awesome? Oh look at that. Beautiful. It's artwork before my eyes. Oh yeah. Look at all the colors. I have to do what? You got to polish all the onions off because we're going to use that for the street tacos also. Okay. I see. I see some co-star. Co-star. Iconage. Voila. Yeah. All right. So I have um, I have an open massive here. I'm going to start making a patch for it because New Ren needs a lot of synthesizer patches, and I don't want to just use presets. That's what I was kind of doing. If you watch our old New Ren streams, um. My my technique for using presets is just to layer twenty of them together so you don't even recognize the original, um, and it takes a while to find all those layers. So I figure out I'll, I'll just make some less sounding things that are kind of kind of what I would want to use. So first, let me go into let me go into preferences here and uh, get my MIDI set up. Oh, you can't even see the preferences window here. Perhaps for the better, because I have 35 MIDI devices. Oxygen 61. I have this little keyboard set up next to me just, just in case I need mod wheel, but I'm mostly using the push now for MIDI. Cool. All right. Matt, you like making synth patches? I do. It is a it is a fun thing. I think it's cool to take a mathematical algorithm or formula and turn it into a piece of art. Dank beats. Turn it into utter dankness. Turn it into some uh, uh, cyber filth. All right. Let's start with the waveform. I'm just going to go with a, a traditional saw and make a super saw patch just to show how easy it is. So that's the attack. You see this envelope right here? It's getting, it's getting longer. So now, by doing that, I can make it so that it fades out quicker or faster or... Yeah, I'm super hyped for New Ren now, man. Oh my gosh. It's taking so long to get everything to gel. Just to just, just have the idea in my head about how the story is going to go, how the characters are going to go, which other characters we need. Right on. We'll be doing some voice acting in-house, in addition to the amazing voice of Miss Seely. I've been practicing my uh, been actions <laughs> if you'll need to turn back. Whatever, this is done. Okay, thank you, Matthew, for cutting my onions. <sighs> Go in the corner and cry, please. Holding it back so long. <laughs> I'm almost crying from here. And it's across the building from us. Man. Okay, so. Now that I have a, an envelope can set. You, can you rinse that for me? Yeah. Let's put a filter on this thing. <laughs> it's so loud. <laughs> cool. 
cut off. All right, so I I kind of do want a resonant sweep like that, but I'll use a low pass four. Now, Jake, for those of us who don't know, what's the difference between a low pass four and a low pass two? <laughs> Aha! It's how many poles you have. They call them poles because they're areas where the EQ cuts off. Mm. It's the the the. I believe it's the, it affects the smoothness of the of the sound of the filter suite. Versus this one's a bit more harsh sounding, so the the four is going to sound a little smoother and just more mellow. That is a lot of cilantro. Ah. What's, what's going on here, guys? Wirecast. What you got? Wirecast. Wirecast. Did Wirecast crash? Yeah, that's the greatest thing about actually streaming or using two computers now. Our stream computer actually doesn't go down, neither does our audio. But the video does? The video will, but we don't lose the actual... We just oh, no. reboot it really fast. Yeah, but we lost the video, though. It's all saved. Why, it, go, it goes. It goes well because you know people can still hear me talking. Because it's wirecast right now. Yeah. So yeah, if our if our yeah, unlike the tricaster, if our like like Robbie just said, if uh, if our video goes down, we're still online, so we just got to reboot the video switcher. Yeah, with the tricaster though, it was like psh, we're all off the air for like five minutes while you reboot the entire yeah, computer, and nice. half the audience leaves. That's that's always fun. Yeah. Whenever we crash, we should just recite dirty limericks. That's a good idea. <laughs> Okay, Matt, you start. There once was a man named Ray who fashioned... No, no, Matt. There once was a man from Valencia. Uh, I, I'm not even going to... It's catchy. Come on. Okay. The trash guy. I'm, I'm hooked up to the thing. I can't take it out. Okay. This knife's pretty sharp. Yeah, yeah I was about to say that knife's sharper than the... Yeah, this knife's nice kicking. I wouldn't say it's kicking. It's, it, it, it is. It is. It's kicking compared to the other one. Like I would actually, I could cut myself on this one. Yeah, you could. The other one, not so much. Whoa, nice. I love those tomatoes. They're so good. Yeah. Something about tomatoes from Vallarta is just like. Cool. Yeah. If anybody's watching us, if you guys got a Vallarta near you, go there. Yeah, Their produce is always run, so run. good. And their marinade for their uh, their meats is also excellent. All right. So All right. So I'm gonna put an envelope on here. Whoa. All right, so now I'm going to mix this stuff together first. You got something to mix that with, Rob? Uh, normally I just use a fork. Um, my... Where'd the metal forks at, right, man? Let me, let me clean one out of the sink. There's one in the sink. I'll just... Thank you. All right, so check it out. We need a dishwasher other than Matt Hull. Wait, wait, wait. We'll go back to this really fast. Hmm. Who's uh, who's on? There we go. All right. Oh, are we back on? We've been on for a while. All right. So anyway, so yeah, but 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 I don't see the NDI output on my monitor screen, so I don't have a courtesy monitor. Oh, you might have to just um, you might have. To, he's restarting right now for you. Okay. Word. So anyways, so check it out. So we got the avocado in there, cilantro. We got tomatoes, and we've got some red onions. Is that serrano? I don't play that game. You're not putting a serrano in there. Not yet, dude. You got to mix this up up first. You season it first, then you add that on for the kick. Watch. Trust me. Although, I do wish I did get some more avocados for this. That looks good. What do you know? Well, I mean, for all of us. Well, I'm not going to... I'm going to have like one or two chips now. Get the Matt Hall seal of approval. You're just going to do a chip and then dip. Chip and then dip. Mm -hmm. Get the hell out of here. Good old chip and dip. Mm -hmm. 
Let's put a reverb on this, right? Oh, baby girl. Okay, the only problem. Oh, yeah. oh, you know what? Do we have Lowry's no. in the tech uh, garlic salt in there? You put Lowry's garlic salt. Yeah, you got it. Cause I picked I picked up a brand from Viarta, which I'm not too familiar with. I want to Old Bay. We no. got Tajin. <laughs> I'm not sure I want to put Old Bay in the guac. We Make got it like garlic powder. Maryland guac. Yeah. Crab amole. There should be some. I think there is some in there. I bought it one time. Oh, there we go. Lowry's. Yeah, give me that bad boy. Okay. Cool. All right, so you don't go crazy with it. It's very little bit. Whoa, that would suck. <laughs> oh, that looks good. Yeah, and that's that's pretty much it. That's all you do. It's just a little bit of the seasoning. All right. All right. All right. Open All up. Right. Open up that bag of chips. Open that bag of chips. Open the bag of chips. I gotta taste where it's at first before I add the uh, the special ingredients. Cool. Okay. Also, Viarta chips are always amazing. Their tortilla is also amazing. They make them in house. Yep. Right there. I watch them get made all the time. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Oh, yeah, it's good there on a Saturday just to set up a lawn chair. Yeah, I do. I go in there. I eat chicken and drink horchata and. Watch the old lady make the tortillas and somebody throw them in a deep fryer. It's the best. You just quietly watch. <sighs> I observe. Quietly watch with a bucket of popcorn in my lap mm. and a hole cut through it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. All right. So, uh, wait, are we back up with the. Oh, yeah, we're back up with the. All right, cool. <laughs> nice. Yeah, horchata is pretty amazing. Horchata is amazing. What it's up, James Rogers? Fat. How's it going? No, this knife is terrible. Oh, knife knowing ya. There knife you go. knowing ya. Yeah, have mine set so that if I go to the other screen, it it blanks out the screen, so that if I gotta do it, like privacy mode for a second, somebody sends me a freaking nudie. I could be like, yeah. I keep telling Matt to stop sending you nudies, but he I'm sorry, it. I can't help it. I Sometimes know, I just wake up in the morning and I look between my legs and I'm like, it's so beautiful, I have to share. It's literally a compulsion, I get it, but I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm cool with it, others may not be. Okay. Cool, that's sounding pretty cool. I'm gonna make like hundreds of these. I forgot the lime juice. Mm. I want to see how long it would take them to figure out that I mean, there I are no limes in the guacamole. I'm like, it's missing something. <laughs> it's missing something. There you go. Now you figured it out. <laughs> it's not a very ripe one. Yeah, yeah you gotta. It's fine. You gotta get a lot out of there. Oh my god. Do I have a presets folder? All Please right. Tell me, I got a presets folder. Let's try this. Here's your chip. All right. What do you think? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, that's crunchy. That sounds really satisfying. I think you use more lime. Maybe yeah. a little salt. I think more salt. Yeah, more salt, more lime. I don't think about, not about the lime, but definitely the salt. I would pull more lime. That's just me. Well, when you make guacamole next week, let's see I'm what fine. you do. I will. That's a, that's a bit over the lime, i got to say. Oh. Uh. Hey. All right. I'm trying to figure out where my patch. There it is, patches. My Drum template. I didn't even spell that right. All right. Better. It's decent. Yeah. I've made better, but it's all right. I'd even throw the rest of that Serrano in there. It could use some more heat. Think so? Yeah, I do. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's up to you. It's your walk. A little bit more. I like everything I make to be zesty as hell, so. <laughs> zesty as hell. When you go down to hell, it's just going to be a bunch of lemons and limes growing everywhere, and you're like, fuck, yeah. that's all you have to drink. You know? Welcome! I'm Satan. You may know me by other names, but one thing is for sure it's zesty down here. Come have a tequila with Hitler. Really, what you want is the seeds. Seeds is what gives it that ump. 
All right, I just made a basic super saw patch because you just have to have one, but it's at least got some filters and reverb, so it, it's not a total phone-in. Yeah, some more cilantro help out a little bit too. All right, cool. Let's make a new one. I'm just going to start churning out presets. Wait, let's see how it comes out. Okay. No. That's good. No. I live with that. We should probably have a mute your mic when you're crunching on something rule. Maybe. I'm gonna start playing drums to to you crunching. In fact, I gotta get my I gotta get my Omnipad here. Hang on. Where is it? Where is my drum rack? So make it the tacos. No okay. Matt. What? I'm so not making foil on that so people don't keep dipping into it because we don't have that much. No, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not dipping it. I said I'd have two. I had three. And that was Robbie, by the way, Jake. So if you're gonna drum to it, I muted it now. I'm good. You muted it. I should have gotten a quesadilla or something before I. Right. <laughs> well. I turned out pretty good. Yeah. I still made better, but it's pretty good. I'm impressed. Ben, when you get a chance, you wanna come here and try it? Benjamin. Benjamin, you come try. Benjamin, you try my guacamole, yes? Yeah. I'm not releasing my preset pack after the stream, James. These are for New Ren. I'll release them with New Ren, though. All right, I'm getting off headphones. Word. Are you leaving? Are you getting off mic, though? No, no, I'm not getting off mic. I was just going to go sit. Can you hear me? Yeah, yeah you, you still get to hear him talking to whoever. My headphones are cutting out. Yeah. Okay. All right. Get away from me. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. There it is. Mm. Mm. All right, cool. That works. <laughs> I need to have my drum kit at all times. Just saying. Hey. Yo. Oh, sorry. Now you have me Yelp map. All right, cool. We got drums. I'm not really going to use them for anything. I just got to have them like a security blanket. I, w I gotta get. I really need a hat brim cam. Where'd everyone go? I'm here. I just didn't think you wanted to hear me chew. I'm looking for some tin foil. Oh, it's right behind me. Dumbass. Cool. All right. I'm gonna go back and mess with Matt with more. All right, cool. Put this in the fridge. Ooh, all that phasing though. Hey, uh, hey, Ben. Oscillate around here. But that's way, way, way too fast. Slow. So I can stay for another two minutes and then I absolutely have to go. Okay. Why don't you put your headphones on so you can hear what he's doing? I can't hear what I'm doing. I have ears. Not you. MIDI learn this. Burp, burp, burp. So now I have a mod wheel controller. I don't know if you can see the vibrato down there. It's down here. I can see it. Kind of twinkling around. That's when I'm moving the mod wheel. But I don't want it to do vibrato because 
that's for a different kind of music. Nice. For this one, it's going to control. What do you think? You like the guac? Yeah? A Ben Seal approval on that guacamole, man. Sweet. Dude, Ben likes my guacamole. That's pretty impressive, actually. All right? I'm <laughs> <laughs> somebody. <laughs> Your life is not forfeit after all. No, it would help if I put a filter there. Okay, let me ask you a question. Who empties a trash can without putting a new bag in and just walks away and thinks it's done? Not me. I don't even empty the trash. <laughs> I know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Matthew. Oh, I don't have any signal coming out of here. I want it to be parallel, and I want. Why is it not coming out of here? Oh. What am I missing here? All right, Evan. Okay, I got to put a new trash bag in so I can throw stuff away. Hold on a second. I'll be right back. Hmm. I just want to have my headphones on. I can still talk. Hey. It's a good thing. Wouldn't want to have you not talking here. No. Ugh. Oh. Duh. I was like, why can't I... Tell Matt this defeats the purpose of changing the trash can out so I could throw stuff away and put a trash bag in it. <laughs> a barn wouldn't even have him. <laughs> All right. Got my, bump, got my headphones back on. No you? idea what I just dropped there. Brrr, who cares? It's like it's my pacemaker. Oh, um. All right, let's do a stepper. Stepping out. Where is the stepper control? Oh, performer. It's time to put the meat on.
give it a little bit of a a, a, a wave. Let me give it that vaporwave sound. Vaporwave. Doggy, getting out of here. Actually, let's take that out of there and put it here. Because we have a minus five, a plus five. At maximum, it'll go up a quarter ton. All right, hold on a sec. I get some. I'll be right back. I'm telling you, we need to get some better silver in here. Winds of change. Sudden. Yeah, this is like taco ambience. <laughs> I love the idea of that, that that's a thing that we can do now, simultaneously. Oh, yeah. Simultaneous four-day time cube. Taco cube. Taco cube. Well, I'm telling you right now, after today, I'm going to buy all new silverware in here because we don't have n nothing. Yeah, man. This kitchen's... The kitchen itself is great, but the stuff that came with the kitchen, not so much. Well, considering we got it for a rent increase of zero dollars. Right. <laughs> Perhaps a little much on the noise. On me? Or turn on. No, 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 no. On the white noise. I'm, I'm programming a synth patch with noise. Yeah. I just need a little... I don't want it to sound like you're outside, like on a mountaintop. Save that as uh, buttress. <laughs> I call that buttress. Let's make a new one. So we have. Whoa. No. Where is my recent profile? Filter size. So long, get browser. I need to create my own bank. <laughs> Does it, did it save it into here? Didn't, I'm gonna have to filter sauce.
All right, let's check this meat. Oh my God, it's perfect. figure that out later. Uh, let's do a base. I haven't do I haven't done a base yet today. So the time. to go to a velocity sounding good sounding good this has got to be monophonic though Mac Zero. Ooh. Cool. My uh my sound card just died. Hang on. No! No. I'll be your sound card. <laughs> <laughs> Thing is pretty fault tolerant, though. <laughs> fault tolerant, yes. That's a good name for a band. Fault tolerant. <clears throat> Benjamin, come here and check out my beef. Isn't it just for you? No, not on camera. No one can see it. All, All right, right, so I'm gonna do a stepper on this one. This is a cool. This is a cool hack. Stepper. One shot. Do I need to perform for that? I forgot how to make it one shot. Let me check the performer. Actually, if I just want a one shot. 
I could just use an envelope like a normal person. That wow. Let's put a little like space on it here. The Dimension Expander, the Sound Gitterizer. Yes. That sounds phenomenal. It's a little indistinct in the, uh, so I'm going to put an extra tone in there. the drive with that yeah and not so much the vibrato I don't know what defaults that I'm gonna have to save a new default patch it's been a while since I've messed around with massive editing <laughs> about that portamento though. We'll see. Portamento. Oh, you can have the sonic. Portamento. Hey Jake, I'm gonna bring you a taco pretty soon. Oh my god. Of course there is. There's no mid scoop in here, son. Kind of crackerjack operation you're running over there, son.
I think the frequency is actually the mid scoop. Yeah, it can be whatever you want. Oh, the most important part. Pitch bend range. It needs to go all the way down. You're damn right, that's the most important part. You're damn right, right. All right. Ben, come here and taste my meat. Yeah. Although, although, I think that envelope makes it so that it, it... Cool. Yeah! Pitch bend is fundamental. Let's save it. Let's call this... What are we to call this? What's this bass going to be? You guys got to help me name my patches here. Apache. <laughs> Apache. All right, what should we call it? Ooh, Is it everything whoa. that I want it to be? That's oh, good. Yeah. Rob, you know how to whip up some some Vallarta. Vallarta. <laughs> it's not that hot. Not even a job. Not that hot. We should we should do commercials for Vallarta. Vallarta. Yeah, I know. Vierta. I'm making fun of Tupac. You ever see that interview? Nope. Where he talks about like the thing that he most the miss the the thing that he missed the most when he was in jail, and uh, he's like, you know, El Palo Loco. <laughs> it's a yeah. real Tupac quote. All right, Portobellis is what I call good. this one. We're gonna use that in a track for sure. All right, let's create a new one. I can tweak these later as well. Let me just verify. 800% that I'm actually saving these things. Good call. You know? Good call. Let's make sure. Buttress. Hi, Buttress. Why is that monophonic? Please tell me the other one isn't too. All right, I gotta figure out why it's saving in a different way. I'm going to Google this right now. How to save massive bank. <laughs> All right. Last step for me is I got to heat up the tortillas. Tortillas. Which, which sucks because when I got these things, they were fresh. They were piping hot when I got them from Bayarta. I should have came straight here and started cooking. <sighs> all right, all right. All right, let's see if I didn't actually find anything just yet, but I'm going to go ahead and open this other one and see if that also opens up properly oh james rogers wants to see my underwear oh, oh dude yeah. there it is man man you gotta i'm not you gotta pay for extra i'm not sure how happy i am that i just saw that 
Hey, I think I'm very happy. I blame James Rogers. I think I'm very happy. Mm-hmm. Filter saws. Buttress. Beatrice? Yeah, what? Wait a minute. Brief files. Filter saws. Yeah, that has different settings. Maybe I saved it before I changed the units in. Beatrice? Portabellus. Yeah, it's the the max voices doesn't seem to save for the parameter. Really? Yeah, everything else does. Maybe just the max. Whatever, it's just on monophonic, who cares? Mm. Oh, nice. Okay, let's create a new one then. Brand new sound. For a brand new type of guy. Huh? Let's create a... The Ableton push is so good to play for shredding on. Oh my god. Because everything is tuned in force like a guitar. Uh -huh. Except instead of that, it's Kind of like <clears throat> shortcut for getting started, kind of like buying your rice and beans at Vallarta. Like I could start with a waveform that I could probably get by filtering it a certain way, but that blows through half of my filters, so yeah. on this one. Create a partial here. Check out this partial. Get rid of some tacos. Barely even hear it anymore.
give that a little bit of unison spread. Too much. Now we can start with the filter. So I kind of wanted to do that every time I hit the thing. But not too drastically. Also, let's, let's go to a notch filter. Too much. All right, so let's put this on here. little too much ow. Now let's do a little trick here. I'm gonna do a little trick I like to call a pitch bend. A little too much pitch bend there. Still too, it's poke. It sounds like a Yamaha CZ1 phase distortion patch. Uh, I mean, Casio, I, I'm completely on another planet right now. I'm trying to figure out why it's sounding. It's because I have a bandpass filter on it. Maybe if I use a low pass. Ooh, too much resonance. That's that fattening I was looking for. to be velocity sensitive as hell though maybe 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 i can side chain the nope not pan try again nope off i can actually I always try to like work without reverb before I add it because, you know, <laughs> it changes everything. Whoa, zipper effect. All right. Here you go, man. Oh my gosh. Tacos. Tacos. I didn't realize, I thought it was going to be like for the rest of the week. I didn't realize it was like 
Yeah, I didn't buy no. I mean, it was like a test thing. I'm going to buy like a big batch next time. Yeah. But figured you just try it out. Let me know what you think. Yeah. Nice. I don't know what I was expecting. I thought we were going to like like make it and then not eat it tonight and then eat it the rest of the week. No, that was totally what was supposed to be. But I ah. didn't make enough to do that. I didn't buy enough stuff. Right, right. But well, now that I know, the, the recipe. Yeah, now that I know, then well, next time I will I will respectfully refrain from chomping and smacking on Yeah, I don't I don't want to be that guy. <laughs> don't be that guy. It's still too bright. Still too bright. I need to take velocity. Have that going. Yeah. Sounds pretty good. I'm gonna save that. I'll be tweaking all of these, of course. But let's call this. Mm. Let's call this um, orange rice because <laughs> that's what I got right here. It's orange. You see? Look at these delicious tacos that Ravi's created. Well, you can see on the bottom screen. That's the nice thing about Power Block now. But look at this. It's pretty. It's pretty. It's pretty luxurious. I gotta say. Orange rice. Well, if you want tacos, hey, Lumana Tan, what's up? If you want tacos, come down to Minfosha because we got lots of them. It's how we avoid going crazy every day. Not that we do. All right, starting with a fresh new patch. I want to make something ethereal and sort of like evolving. Oh, yeah. Too much release. Too much release. That's all right. I think that's cool how it is. Let's find a good waveform to start with. that silver that's got a built-in partial that's pretty nice kind of like
Let's do let's do a stepper. I like steppers. Not always, but there's a time and a place for a stepper. Synchronized to eighth. So if our metronome is going at 120, it'll uh, one and two enter. There you go. <clears throat> Filter cut off. Adjust the amount. Pseudo random steps here. That sounds cool. Filter to you. I've never seen anybody dive this deep into Master before. Actually spend the time to fine tune it. This is cool. Jake, can you hear me? Yes, sir. Oh, okay, I was just making sure. What's up? Well, I was saying I didn't. No, what never mind. Why did you say something? I just made a comment on what you were doing. I didn't know if you knew oh. me or not. Oh, I thought you were talking about tweaking the tacos. No. <laughs> See, the only danger of us getting distracted here is is uh is me not knowing if you're talking about tacos or or synthesizers. Let me let me let you in a little secret. I'm always talking about tacos. Pretty much, yeah. that definitely to go down to an octave. Hmm. 
That's before reverb. That's why we do that. That sounds pretty dope. Yes, it does. Take that, Vangelis. Eat my doublers. <laughs> <laughs> it's all about doubling and, and detuning. That's how you make synth presets that sound like that. Needs a little bit of noise in there as well. Decker. I need that old blade runner. That sounds dark as hell. I like it. Very nice. That I want footage of that. I want, man, I want to meme you guys like constantly. It's so perfect. Mm. Scrumptious. Scrumptious. I haven't eaten a taco yet because I'm preoccupied as usual on music things. Okay, everybody likes cold tacos too. Yeah, they're pretty good. Um, what are we gonna call this one? We're gonna call this one cold tacos. Cold tacos. Very well done. All right, create a new one. Mm -hmm. I'll do one more, and then I'll I'll I'll, I'll take a taco break. I mean, it's five thirty. We only got a half an hour left on the whole show for today. This is over faster than I than I thought, which is kind of a good thing because you guys will miss us and then come back tomorrow. I don't mean miss like not see us, but if you get eight hours of me rambling all day every day, these guys have to put up with it. And let me tell you, I don't put up with it anymore. I had these headphones. That's right. I can listen to cold tacos. Oh, yeah. All right. I need to go find a beverage. I'll be right back. Put a on this one. Check it out.
It's like ice rain. Sounds Commodore 64 like, doesn't it? Let's make LFO a performer. Random freak. I like this one. Oh, wrong thing. Let's put this in the <laughs> frequency. Sheet. Insert two that I need. Whoa. That's not psychedelic at all. Where is Oscillator 3 fine? That's right, Kirky. Oh, yeah. Filter two. Okay. I'm done with the taco part. Excellent. You want to come in here and make some... Yes. Give me three minutes. I'll be there in three minutes. Got to stop off at the office first. Make the LFO. So that's what 
that will control. Midi learn. Oh yeah. No, I'll put some delay on that. I, I, I still want to richen up the tone a bit. And take the damn vibrato off of this. What are you doing? <laughs> Not random at all, but sounds random. <coughs> Sounds like a radio trying to tune, kind of like in the, uh, in the, oh god, I forget the name of it, the desert part in Earthbound. Like, come in, signal. I kind of feel like I want to not have it decay. Telemetry sounds. Houston? There's all kinds of crap on the line. Alright, now that I have that. Alright, I'm going to call this one 
Station Alpha. <laughs> <clears throat> Let's listen to Cold Tacos. Almost sounds like a Korg wave station patch with a happening in the background there. I gotta make my own bank. I haven't done that yet, but these are just loose presets. That was pretty flayable. Mm, let's see. Portobellis is my awesome bass. It has all kinds of interesting little glitches that come out when you hit it certain velocity. Almost like pinch harmonics on a guitar, kind of like when you just hit the string differently twice and it's... So, let's go to Buttress. That one's fun. And then filter saws. We have all kinds of sounds we made today. Neato. I'm partial to Station Alpha because it just sounds so glitchy and gross. I can turn up the amount of the of of the uh, the tuning frequency. You hear that? Yeah. Beautiful. It's like glitchy cyber dolphins, dog. Nice. All right. That's like a it's like a tenth of a song worth of presets for me. Uh, Sounding good, man. I'm getting there. It's a beginning. I'll, I will still end up like just layering on like 500 different layers of presets in the end. Yeah. Because that's just what I do. Layer, layer, layer until you can't even recognize anything. It's just like a wall of sound. Yep. But, but, but. I want to do. What, what? Oh, yeah. I want to do a, a good. I want to do manual FM using an LFO. a sine wave this isn't gonna sound good though yeah, it does You can do anything. I'll be back. Okay. 
right, so I'm going to start with... Oh. Wrong envelope. <laughs> oh, dear. There you go. I love playing with synths. Now let's do the opposite here. Did I use five or six? I used five. them to cross over or perhaps start Sort of a didgeridoo, didgeridon't. Okay, now no, those are just texture layers. They're not the main part of the sound. I'm gonna do a. Freaking super saw. I kind of like that, but it's not really predictable, so. I guess this one is doing it, so.
It has interesting emergent properties on release. It just goes. Bloom. <laughs> I'm deciding if I want to just let that go or. So when you're making these, do you already have an idea where you're going to use them? A little bit. <laughs> That's robotic as heck. Maybe I will take the level up a bit more. That doesn't have any reverb, mind you. It doesn't? Nope, not yet. But I kind of wish I had a compressor, though. I could just put those on the... Fun fact right there. No filters either. I could just filter the whole thing. I think I will. Uh, yeah. You use them? It's like, it's like wind in the machine city. Tron sounding, I think. Let's save that as um City Orchid. Yeah. City Orchid. I want to go back to Portobellis. That's my favorite sound I think I made today. <laughs> I 
I don't know. I'm not sure if I like portobellos more or this uh, orange rice. It's a pretty standard, like, trancey kind of sound. City sensitive, so there's a lot of dynamics in there. Hmm. Let's see. Well, it's six o'clock. That's our uh, that's our cue to get out of here, right? Um. Yeah. Yes, sir. We're gonna be doing this every day, though. This is every day at work. I'm just gonna work on Nirvan for a couple hours a day, and then shovel night. Uh, probably next week, I'm gonna start on that as well. And we'll sort of we're gonna do a summer camp schedule here at Min Potion from now, and we're gonna just like divide the day up into blocks. Yeah. And then, like, from 10 to 12 is... Ooh, ooh, fun fact. Here's a fun fact. Time. Here's a fun fact. Portamento mushrooms come in all heights and widths. It is absolutely true. Mm. You may not have known that, but... Mm. Is there is another a... one? Do we have any more fun facts? Do we have any... any... I, I bet I have some unfun facts. Oh, come on, Ben. Just press the play button. He's working on it. I really like that sound. I'm going to use that a lot. Fun fact. Spiders need straws in order to drink milk. Did you know? <laughs> that's, a, that's a potentially non-fun fact. If your spider is drinking your milk, when you, it's like you want to go get cereal, but the spider drank it all, it's two different problems that are equally bad. First of all, there's a spider. Second of all, you're going to have to have cereal and water or something because there's no milk. Yes. What was your alternative cereal thing if you had no milk did you ever do, did you just I just, eat it. It. I just ate it right at the bottom oh man my my parents made me put apple juice in cheerios one time that is disturbing yeah man that's that why i'm so disturbing. that's why i'm so messed up now dude maybe if it was like apple jacks right if it was maybe? apple jacks but they don't maybe. even taste like apples that's the entire crux of the commercial is oh to deny God. their apple hood apple jack sounds so uh, weird now their appleosity it's uh appetastic yeah man so all right. That so explains a lot, though. That concludes this power block. We'll see you guys tomorrow at 4 o'clock with something different. Yes, indeed. We're going to be making some adjustments and changes, and you'll see this show evolve. Yeah, see those buttons oh, right there at the top here? Yeah, those aren't going to be that. We're going to make those. Those oh, were we'll placeholders, so I made the real ones, and I didn't get a chance to get it. We're going we're gonna to have a proper header on the stream. I'm not sure about the, the Marquee scrolling both ways. I mean... I'm not sure. We're we're gonna have to do some some uh, but we can do. We, we can, can make some mock-ups and we can just look at them and see which one works, which one doesn't. But the best part of power block is that we can do surgery on the patient while awake. We can just this change stuff out and see what you guys think of it. Oh, it's you like, know what? That's what we then. That, you know what? That's gonna be part of my power block tomorrow. Mm? We'll do that. Prettifying the stream. Prettifying the stream. And just make it fabulous. Prettifying. That will be awesome. I'm gonna go eat a taco, and uh, want to nuke those things. Maybe, maybe. I still got to render out the stems for OKKO this week. It's a big one. So. Yes, you do. But it's done. It's done. I just got to do that. And then, yes, then I can go do. home and play with the puppies. Puppy time. Puppy time. All right. We need some uh, outro. You know what? Maybe uh, tomorrow you can make some outro music for the show. Using the patches I just made. Yes. Maybe. I'm Robbie, and this is Jake, and that was Ben. Thank you for tuning in to Power Blog. Much love. Thank you as always. We'll see you again tomorrow, okay? Same.